Palaroga Shark Media. I'm Olivia, and today we're delving into gratitude for the gift of home. Let's start with the basic shelter our homes provide. A roof over our heads, protection from the elements, and a safe place to rest are fundamental needs that many of us are fortunate to have met. Today, I'm grateful for the physical structure that keeps me safe and comfortable. Consider the comfort of familiar surroundings, the sight of your favorite chair, the smell of your home, the feel of your own bed. These familiar sensations can bring a sense of peace and belonging. I'm thankful for the comfort and security that comes with having a familiar place to return to. Think about the memories created within our homes, whether it's family gatherings, quiet evenings with a loved one, or personal milestones celebrated, our homes are the backdrop for many of life's precious moments. Today, I'm grateful for the memories my home has witnessed and fostered. Let's appreciate the freedom our homes provide. Home is where we can truly be ourselves, express our personalities, and have control over our environment. I'm thankful for the autonomy and self-expression my home allows me. Consider the role of home as a sanctuary. In a busy world, our homes offer a retreat where we can relax, recharge, and find solitude when needed. Today, I'm grateful for the peace and restoration I find within my home. Think about the people who make a house a home. For many, home is defined by the presence of loved ones, family, partners, roommates, or even pets. I'm thankful for the relationships that bring life and love into my living space. Let's not forget about the functionality of our homes. From the kitchen where we prepare meals to the bathroom where we start and end our days, each room serves important functions in our daily lives. Today, I'm grateful for the amenities and conveniences my home provides. Lastly, appreciate how our homes reflect our journeys, the objects we collect, the way we decorate, the changes we make over time all tell a story about who we are and where we've been. I'm thankful for how my home has evolved with me and reflects my personal growth. As we conclude this part of our episode, I encourage you to look around your living space with fresh eyes. What aspects of your home are you most grateful for? How does your home support and enrich your life? Remember, home can mean different things to different people, but its importance in our lives is universal. We'll be right back after a short break with our affirmation of the day. Today's affirmation is, I am grateful for my home and the comfort, safety, and joy it brings to my life. Take a deep breath and repeat this affirmation to yourself. Let it sink in. This simple phrase reminds us of the vital role our homes play in our well-being and happiness. As you go about your day, try to return to this affirmation. Notice the details of your living space that you might usually take for granted. By cultivating gratitude for our homes, we can enhance our appreciation for what we have and create an even more positive, nurturing environment for ourselves and our loved ones. Thank you for joining me on 5 Minutes of Gratitude. I hope this episode and our affirmation inspire you to cherish your home, whatever form it may take. I'll be back soon with more reflections on gratitude. Until then, enjoy the comfort of your home and stay grateful.